now they face off both with different de uh, different decks lately. Uh, Marat was on a Lurin and Green Sun Zenith decks for a while. Sam goes back and forth. Sometimes oops all spells, sometimes burn. Sometimes blue control. Sometimes, uh... Eh, probably something else. I forgot. Lotus Petal. Sometimes Lutri. That's right. Mental misstep. Or minor misstep. <laughs> wow. What the hell is this metagame? Saga? Chromox and printing Burning Wish. Mox Opal now. No Metal Craft past the turn. So. The minor misstep, pretty mean. Um, all right. I'll play more. That was unexpected. Brainstorm. Play it also. I'll try to, you know, it's the, it's the distance of the drive. It's like two hours. Oh, the distance? I want the best from the drive. It's like three and a half. Yeah, three and a half hours. I mean, it depends. If we get stuck in Queens <laughs> going in circles, it's like five hours. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> um, that's the thing. It's like, do I really want to do that? <laughs> the weekly, I mean, the monthly is good. It's always the first Saturday of every month. And you're always in. The way he does it is uh, and, uh, um, and, uh, entry is full store credit. Lion's Eye Diamond for Marat. A lot less scary than it looked originally. Yeah, I was like, oh, I'm going to die. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's, uh, uh, yeah, it's in the graveyard. All of that. We'll see you later. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably reasonable. Okay. All right, a brainstorm will resolve. Well, Metal Craft is turned on, so we're up and running. Lion's Eye Diamond, a uh, an old favorite. I think Burning Wish gave away what we're up to to some extent. I think Sam knew what Marat was playing, but he didn't. It's pretty clear at this point. It's Lion's Eye Diamond Control. All right, so Prismatic Vista getting correct. Good thing against control decks is that when you, when your storm is that you have time. You don't have to go off on turn one. Your hand isn't going to get shredded most of the time. This is this is a just guy deck. No thought sees, no hint to Turok or something. I'll say I thought it was part of it. And force of will, stuff like that. Although we saw a minor misstep earlier in this game. Not really that big of a deal. You know, a lot of the Storm decks now have Veil of Summer ready to go. But the Jeskai deck isn't presenting a clock. It is important to take note. Ponder. Yeah, 
Yeah, Delusional Crowd is Marat in the chat. Sorvel Lands also helped Storm with these matchups to set up a solid turn to go off when there is no pressure. Yeah. <clears throat> the Sorvel Lands have definitely made their impact on Legacy, and for the Storm decks, it's no different. They're running, they're running the Sorvel Lands to sort the top of their deck as well. Now a ponder from Marat, also trying to figure out what would be a good time to get this party started, I would say. When would be a good time? Four cards in hand now? A little past turn. Uh, battle wager. I'm just going to pass. I'll put two counters on it. Sam fetching here. Likely that Sam has some interaction in hand. Often in these game ones, you end up with like swords to plowshares in hand and stuff like that, some dead cards. Yeah. Right, there's a brainstorm. about this brainstorm for a moment yep yeah. don't know if there are any miracles involved in sam's deck triumph of saint catherine or anything like that there's narset which is which is pretty relevant echo of eons doesn't like that activating narset now Marset actually pretty good. Marat could fight through it, but it, it does make things a bit harder. <laughs> Back to basics is selected. Okay. It's going to be some disruption right there. Nine for turn. Mm -hmm. You have seven in hand. Five. Five cards in Sam's hand. Here's a burning wish. I think last time I left, a lot of one of these results that didn't work so well for me. <laughs> Sam says, I think the last time I let one of these resolve, it did not go well for me, in case anybody missed that. Uh, yeah, so they can often find some nasty stuff out of the sideboard with Burning Wish. For this exact situation, I'm not really sure what Marat would be looking for. I mean, there's a chance we'll get a couple of rituals into... Hmm... Yeah, it, it's possible to just find thought seeds, but that doesn't seem that important right now. But we don't know Marat's hand. Force pitching back to basics, burning wishes counter. Yep. <laughs> Marat with only three cards in hand. This Narset is a pretty big problem. 
All right, delusional crowd in the chat says that would be correct. Thought sees would have been the selection if it had resolved. Yeah, it may also just be bait. It's always a possibility. Orion revealed. Is revealed? If I had the money, I would actually pay for it myself. Just to like the whole thing. Yeah, Grape Shot could shoot in our set, that's true. <laughs> could also do one of those short chains and make a bunch of goblins or empty the warrens or something like that. I wasn't really sure what direction Marat was going to go with that Burning Wish, but it's countered, so that's that. Usually at this point in the game, we get a glimpse at players' hands, but I haven't seen much of anything so far. Island cycling with Lorien revealed now. Let's see, basic islands. Plays it. Prismatic ending. With the Chromox, I guess. We needed Sam to make a free to not commit fraud and then bring back Jerry's. Who's that? Sex. The GFTX guy who just got 25 years. Oh, okay. I thought, I thought it was after the Chromox, but LED makes a lot of sense. I guess based on where it was on the table, I thought it was aiming at Chromox. All right. Fetching with Misty Rainforest. Maybe we're going to see Marat Surveil. There it is. Under City Sewers. One, two. Yes. Four, and then five. Yeah. Um, after this, I'm going to leave the page. Survey on the stack. So L does um, $50 entry for the one monthly, but it's leave that whole so entry. Go to my track, give it as credit. Drop to sure. top eight. Sure. So, like, first place, usually we average uh, uh, like fetch okay. 30. All right, Bayou is found with Bloodstained Mire. Three. Uh, yeah. Uh, he plays. He just won the uh, Rose Petal. one. Yeah, he is. I saw him in uh, Pittsburgh when he won. Um, the guy got like DQ or something. Yeah. He shouldn't have been his time. Yeah, the dude was just all about his own fire. Yeah, he's up here. 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 Well, Summer, Storm is now too. Marat will be presenting Storm with these goblin tokens. So, under the protection of Veil of Summer now, we're going to proceed. Let's see what we got. Yeah. Cabal ritual with threshold. Yeah. Five. Five black mana with Cabal ritual. Oh, yeah. Black. Black. So, one, three here. Two black. There's a lot of them. I'll cast Beseech. Bargaining Yeah. Storm. Okay, so Beseech sacking the Mox Opal. Finds a Beseech. Bargain. Casting it, sacking Chrome Mox. And I'll do the same for the Low Spittle. Wooden ones with the Thunder Classic. Bargain. Well, it makes new ones now. They're completely wood. Port a lot of them, and they have like a little pressure thing on them. Money and graves. Yeah, the eyes roll. But the cast eyes roll. That's good. Yeah, I like the when it can do pressure like this. I mean, this is. Storm is now seven after Gaia's will. Gaia's will resolves. The other thing is, like, I would love to keep everything super like, compact. Yeah, that kind of good. Awesome. Oh, yeah. And I believe Sam has conceded here. And Marat reveals tendrils of agony. Game one goes to Marat. No, I want to stay. Oh, wait, you can. Okay. That's the whole thing. Uh, okay. Or else I would have left. Did you have enough? 
Did yeah, yeah, yeah. So, no, no, I didn't touch my graveyard. So, no, no, I had two mana floating, so three. Yeah. <laughs> because I could get Metalcraft by playing this. And then if I call it again, I'm going to get to uh, more two, like, three and a half, normally. And then I have enough to beseech again. And then. Okay, Sam just double checking for the sake of learning what would happen after Gaia's will. And uh, Twitch Chat said. Sam was dead, and Sam was, in fact, dead. Yeah, Sam just wanted to uh, better understand what would happen after Gaia's will to be sure it was correct to scoop there, which it was. So moving on to game two, Sam will be on the play. That's just four, right? That's about the uh, yellow one. Lotus Petal for Sam. What does that mean, chat? What does that mean? Why would Sam have a Lotus Petal? <laughs> Any guesses? That's in it. Turbo back to basics, maybe. <laughs> Turn one cannonist would have been sick, yeah. After a conductor Scott hoping for a Jeskai victory, it seems. Lotus Petal, believe it or not. That's going to resolve. <clears throat> All right, so fetching and then casting a ponder. Yeah, I don't have to. It's just eight spells. So this one I would have to pay for. Blood Stain Mire now. <coughs> Maybe going to Surveil. Will it be Undercity Sewer? Will it be Commercial District? We're on the edges of our seats. Undercity Sewer it is. Okay, so everyone that guessed Undercity Sewer is right. Well done. Filling my water. <laughs> Gotta have water on standby. <laughs> All right, Cervell left the card on top. Something to take note of. Marat liked it. Lotus Petal is curious. As we saw in game one, Murad has no problem fighting through a handful of counter spells thanks to Vel of Summer. Beat a Narset as well. We saw the Beseech into Beseech into Beseech line. Mox Opal Storm is one. 
LED storm is too. Doesn't seem like you want to aggro like any body like. No, no, no. I know. It's like I'm looking more so initiative, not like aggro. Yeah, you're like. Okay. Some of you, some for whatever reason, hate the label. You are. You know what it is? It is. Uh huh. You are more aggressive than like. LED has resolved. Now Chromox Storm is three. Any spells Sam chooses to fire off, remember, ups the storm count. Looks like four cards left in Marat's hand. So far, nothing that has hit the stack seems like a must counter. <laughs> Chromox is imprinting nothing, I guess. Galvanic Relay. Four total copies. And you know what, for the purposes of this, will be my life as well. Slash initiative one. Oh. Initiative gets like two. such bad clips. Pendril, uh, Ponder, Tendril, Song of Creation, and Dark Ritual. Not sure that uh, Marat wanted me, yeah, wanted that to be the four cards off the top. Delusional Kraut says, worst relay in Storm history. Yeah, that was, that was pretty bad. That was pretty bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now Narset is at the table, which is good news for Sam. Mm -hmm. exactly. Yeah, exactly. It wouldn't be more I'd be interested in seeing these uh, 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 People that play other formats, okay. too, are like, uh, there's always a mono black hybrid. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck tokens. Mm-hmm. It could be Teferi cat combo, right, chat? Could be. I don't know. That's incredible. No, it's just like that it's more black aggro. All right, Meltdown is found and Meltdown is fired off. Blows up three artifacts. That was pretty mean. I think if I I actually drew that. Yeah, I got one in stones and I drew on it. It's going to be tough to beat Narset and tough to recover after Chromox, Opal, and Lion's Eye Diamond roll blown up. A brainstorm, and there's a Narset on the battlefield, so that wasn't very good. All right, maybe you take back here. Thank you, Sam. Sorry about that. You're good. Uh, I don't know exactly what's in Little Smith. It's in Japanese. Yeah, yeah. They're all just, all just weird cards. Oh, uh, just weird. Yeah. <laughs> I'll talk to you tomorrow. like the worst. Galvanic relay in the world, I think. You're good. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think Brainstorm into Narset is way worse than Brainstorm into Chains. At least Brainstorm into Chains, if you have cards in hand, you can still technically draw your cards. But you'll just have to discard in between each draw. Hellbent is another story. It's unlikely we'll see this tendrils or song of creation get played this turn. 
ponder is a big maybe with Narset on the battlefield. Is it worth it just to sort the car top cards of the deck or shuffle? with two black floating. I think if you're Sam, especially since we know one of the cards in Mara's hand is Brainstorm, can feel good about countering his Burning Wish. I think you can't even name a card that's strong too. Yes, I only cast uh, the Dark Patrol and now it's. Oh, you're good. I know. Storm is two. Saga? Sure. Can you grab it? Yeah. I was just joking because you didn't know. No, it's just a good card. I'm at 14, I get 8. Fast 3 fights. Okay, Harry seems to think Marat has Vale in hand. I didn't see that, but that's possible. Even then, it's not end of the world. I mean, Marat will not be able to draw off of the Vale. Force pitching Supreme Verdict. Supreme Verdict likely left in in case goblins get all over the place. Yeah, Audrey saying you can't uh, beseech from here. Likely going for Empty the Warrens, if anything. The Daddy, thank you for the raid. Welcome, everybody. We're here watching some Tabletop Legacy. Locals here in New York City. And Storm is three. Bell of Summer on a Force of Will, Burning Wish, might be resolving. All right, Burning Wish will resolve. What do we find? Hmm. Siege the mirror. Okay. To be fair, very well as could have. And then right. yeah. pass the turn. So I was like, yeah, I'll go with three. So it seems like Marat's hand is just brainstorm beseech. Hasiak Dream Render. We, we actually saw this card appear on stream earlier. This this is the most Ashiaks we've had on stream maybe ever. Uh, targeting myself. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, so uh, like uh, for, uh, I'll just check what you milled and I'll scoop. And no. What are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Murat can't believe there's an annul in the deck, but uh, that's the way it goes. All right, going to game three. And then that way, it's like I can just go over what our win conditions are and just play one or two issue creatures. All right. Just play one or two. All right. You're on the second time. I mean, not just that would be like the game. It's my... All right, Marat is on the play. Looks like Marat molt is six. We're ready to go. Game three. Yeah. 
Yeah. Alright, Lion's Eye Diamond. Mox Opal, Storm is three. Is Sam going to get a turn one in this game, or is this going to end? It looks like Marat has... Hmm, can't make out what's in hand. Looks like another Crow Mox, maybe a Burning Wish and a Dark Ritual? Is that what's in hand? I think so. No, yes. This is a That makes sense. Yeah. I mean, yeah. 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 What's next? Uh, uh, yeah. burning wish. I really like Mars right prior now. to crack this for I really like that card. I mean, turn one. Uh, okay, burning wish resolves. Sacked LED for three black. Storm is five. Basically, like, uh, against Delver, it's like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I'm also looking like so lame. Yeah, yeah, so I have yeah, just three black. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Defense for yeah, the yeah, saga. Sure. And see if I can, like, muscle it out. It's been talking for the one. Yeah, coming off guard on game one, I was like, there is going to be like six, six, and seven, seven. So we're really like, coming more and more. I was like, I'm sure we're going to be able to pick up the game one and before I knew it, it was already dead. So. Yeah, missing the land drop was. There is a way to just be ultra pretty. Sure. It would be like, like I have to get a shot. I don't have to get a shot. I don't have to get a shot. That's fair. I used to have a shot. Okay, empty the Warrens. It's going to be 12 goblins, it looks like. Yeah. Uh, 12 yeah. 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 All right, there's 12 goblins from Marat. Pass the turn. Set up Terminus. I think that might be the only way. It gives the monarch to the other person. Yeah. Right, yeah. Fine, yeah. Case, yeah. No cards. And without a duel, it's going to be extra difficult. Yeah. 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 Fist bump. That is the match. Marat gets it on Storm. GG's.